Hello, welcome to A Mug Full of Wine. Today is grocery shopping day and meal planning day. Well, Sunday is meal planning day, but today is grocery shopping day. I thought I'd share our meals and our grocery list before we go grocery shopping and do our grocery haul. I'm actually thinking about going to Aldi today. I'll have to ask Mackenzie what she thinks. I watch lots of Aldi hauls, and I may just go check it out. So for um, dinners this week, tonight we're having bagel sandwiches with fruit and chips. Tuesday, pulled pork, mac and cheese, and veggies. Wednesday, fish sandwiches with veggies and fruit. Thursday, breakfast burritos with hash browns. We're going to have to go to Trader Joe's because they have the best hash browns ever. Mm -hmm. On Friday is called One Pot Zucchini Mushroom Pasta. I've never made it before. The kids will have TV dinners because they don't like zucchini or mushrooms. So that's what we will do on Friday. Uh, it's, this is my one meal of the week that I haven't done. I, you know, the one meal. I always try something new every week. This is it. Saturday we go out, and on Sundays we grill. But I don't know what we grill because we start our week on Sundays. I don't know if that makes sense. There's my grocery list. Not too long. I always end up adding on to it at the last moment, though. And that is our grocery plan for grocery and meal plan for the week. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yeah. Yeah. Thumbs up. Hello, and welcome back. We are going to do um, my Walmart haul, my Aldi haul, and my Trader Joe's haul. We're going to start with Walmart because I have frozen stuff. We bought this um, buffalo cauliflower, steamed fresh pack things, pasta and broccoli with um, cheese sauce, cars shaped noodles, some corn. Pasta with peas and um, Parmesan cheese sauce, and they are the noodles are shaped like Anna and Elsa. Mm -hmm. So Logan will be excited about that. Mm -hmm. um, of course, our weekly box of mini swirls ice cream cones. The kids get one of these at night if they finish their dinner. And since there's only eight, that means only four nights. We got a backup ice cream. The kids are, my kids are homeschooled, so I don't have to pack them one of those fancy school lunches every day, so they get to eat what they would like. Piper always picks these out. She has two of the pizza snack rolls and one wheels and cheese. Um, this week, on Friday, I'm making a meal that I'm not positive that both kids will like. Piper may like it. Logan for sure won't eat it. It has mushrooms in it. So I bought two kids TV dinners just in case Piper doesn't want to eat what we're having. She can have one of those and I think most 100% sure Logan won't eat it. We also um, bought some fish sandwich fillets. I saw on another vlog um, when I was searching, looking at all the what we have for dinners that someone made fish sandwiches out of these and suddenly I was like, I don't think I've ever done that before. So we're going to have fish sandwiches one night this week with those. I also bought some eggs in Home Ec this week. I'm going to teach the kids how to scramble an egg. And then we're having egg burritos one night. And we've got some flour tortillas to go with the egg burritos. We also bought some rolls for our pulled pork. I wanted pretzel rolls. And, of course, they didn't have them at Walmart. Always. It always happens to us. I also got a box of macaroni and cheese, and we got some bananas and some mayo, and a box of Pop-Tarts that my family likes to have as a snack, and it's the value pack. Um, I don't usually eat lunch, but I'm going to try to start eating lunch, so I picked up a couple of these creamy tomato Campbell soups in your hand thing because I love soup. We saw this. We've never tried it. It's avocado ranch. We love avocados. Mm. I don't know what we're going... I, we're not having salad this week, but we bought the salad dressing anyway. And we also got, thank you Piper for being a helper, some Sweet Baby Ray's honey barbecue sauce for our pulled pork for tomorrow night. Look at the little bees. Mm. Little bees. We also bought some iced sweet tea. We have two packs of yogurt for Piper. Yay. We have um, eight 
peach and strawberry yogurts for myself, plus two blueberry. I'm supposed to eat two yogurts a day for the next um, five days, and then I probably will never eat yogurt again. Mm -hmm. I have some salted mocha car or caramel mocha creamer. This, in my opinion, is the best creamer that they've ever made. Mm -hmm. Some butter, spreadable butter, some cream cheese, which we're going to use for dinner tonight. Logan, for his lunch, he likes these pizza Lunchables, so he gets one of these, and I picked up three. And some coleslaw to go with our pulled pork um, tomorrow. So that is my Walmart haul. I think I spent $90, and that will feed, um, this, these are for seven breakfasts, seven lunch, and six dinners, because we go out Saturday night. Next, I'm going to put away my frozen stuff, and then I will have my Aldi haul. This is our Aldi haul. Start out, uh, so let me first preface it by saying I have only been to Aldi one other time in my entire life. It was many years ago when I was a single parent or a divorced parent. And um, I went there because my friends used to tell me how great their boxed potatoes were. So I went and I picked up a box of potatoes and I bought a couple of other things, some eggs and whatever. And the next day, I excitedly made my box of potatoes, and there were bugs in it, and I never went back to Aldi. And I, this was my first time back in probably, I'd say, 13 years or so. So we will see how it goes. Um, my mom shops at Aldi. I have friends that shop at Aldi. I watch a lot of Aldi hauls. I never really hear anybody complain, so maybe it was just a bad day in Aldi World for the potatoes? I don't know. So, this is my haul. We bought these organic... Yes, the cat is like your baby. We bought these Aldi, uh, or these uh, Simply Nature Kids Organic Chocolate Teddy Grams for a snack. We have hamburger buns for our fish fillets, some fruit cocktails, some mandarin oranges, some sweet relish to make my own um, tartar sauce. We found these sprinkles. They were only 99 cents. Usually these are like $5, $7. I don't know. More than 99 cents. So I got two of them. They are different. And we can use them for Christmas cookies. We got these sandwich skinnies. My mom and dad eat these all the time. And uh, so those are from Mackenzie. We got three packages of bagels. A um, everything bagel and two plain for our dinner tonight. We are having bagel sandwiches. We bought these sweet potato potato chips from Mackenzie. These sea salt and cracked peppered kettle chips. My parents had them at their house the other day when we went there for dinner. And my kids... Logan devoured them. Piper helped, uh, no, but I... Logan devoured them. And then, um, <laughs> excuse me, cat. We have this, these barbecue potato chips. We got a box of spaghetti. We got some ketchup. I don't know how their ketchup is, but we will find out. Mackenzie wanted this sweet corn in these little containers, which I like think is I weird. Like Piper got some... Um, mixed fruit in those little containers. She likes to have those for breakfast. We also bought this ginormous bag of kale. It was $2. We usually buy our kale at um, Trader Joe's and it's for $2, the same amount. It's about half of this enormous bag of kale. She uses this in her smoothies. Mushrooms for dinner on Friday. This uh, cream cheese spread is for dinner tonight. This cream cheese spread is also for dinner tonight. Pepper jack cheese for dinner tonight. Provolone cheese. Extra sharp cheese. Strawberry cream cheese for breakfast with the leftover bagels. And pumpkin spice cream cheese because Mackenzie is a teenager and everything is all about her pumpkin, pumpkin spice. Am I right? Yeah. Yes. And she got a mug today. That's right. Pumpkin and some heavy whipping cream, which is also for dinner yeah, Friday wait, night. Yeah, we got this. So that is yeah. our Aldi haul. Oh, and a container of juice. Oh, excuse me. Cranberry pomegranate for the hubby. And a <laughs> thing of Gatorade, fruit punch Gatorade. I am supposed to drink one Gatorade a day. 
I don't like Gatorade, so we are going to try the fruit punch flavor. And if I don't like them, the kids can have them. <laughs> that was our haul from Trader Joe's. No, Aldi. I mean, sorry, I'm Aldi, and it was fifty dollars. So so far, we're up to uh, one forty for our weekly groceries. I usually spend anywhere between one fifty and two hundred, depending on what kids are going to be at our house that week and what we have going on. So, so far I am under budget by quite a bit. Next is our Trader Joe's haul. Yay. Finally, our very small Trader Joe's haul. We had some petite peas for dinner Friday night. Mm -hmm. Zucchini also for dinner Friday night. Trader Joe's hash browns. These hash they're browns delicious. are fantastic. They're delicious, aren't yeah, they? They're delicious. Yeah. Um, they're really super, super good. Those are for Thursday. More bananas because um, all the bananas at every store we went to were really kind of green, not yellow enough. So we had more bananas and we picked up the Tea Tree Tingle conditioner to go with the Tea Tree Tingle shampoo that we bought last week. So that is our little Trader Hall, Trader Joe's <laughs> Hall. It was um, $11. Twelve dollars, so that brings our total to one fifty-two ish yeah. for all three stores for one week of breakfast, one week of lunch, six nights of dinner, and um, snacks throughout the day for the Munchkins.